What's up everyone, it's Dan here at Vivid Racing and we are going to flash our project Can-Am with our VR2 and ECU flash. Of course, you guys have seen us posting this forever, so now we're gonna actually load the file to the car. So here we go. All right, so the first part in flashing is we got the cable hooked up to the diagnostic port. No need to remove the ECU or send it into anybody or anything, simple flashing. Um, this is our 195 horsepower file, so it takes it up from 172 stock. We also have a big injector file that gives you 235 horsepower on 100 octane and 225 on 91 octane. So we've got cable plugged in, program ready to go, and we just need to turn the ignition on. Ignition is on, all the cool stuff lights up that you haven't seen yet. So now we'll go ahead and click the next button. Next, next. and pulls up the VIN. So we select our ECU type, hit next, and do not calculate checksums, hit OK. Program, yes, select our file. And now it's gonna start programming the ECU. It takes about two to three minutes. And once that gets going here, we will then show you the remainder of the process. So we haven't shown off this car officially, but here's a little sneak peek. It's got some really rad stuff going on in the carbon fiber world, from agency power, the fuel wheels and tires, the insanity on the inside and decent, drift brake handle, reflex, um, controls there, gauges from Razorback, uh, custom Hyphonics drop-in head units, rugged radios, we got more Hyphonic speakers. We've got all types of accessories back here. Custom agency power exhaust, Valvetronic, gold tips. Gold heat wrap. Suspension by MTS, agency power sway bar links. So we'll show you a full reveal a little bit later that you can see in-depth pictures, but uh, this thing's gonna be sick. So we're gonna be doing a big turbo upgrade as well as camshafts real soon. So stay tuned for that. All right, we got about 15 seconds left out of the two, three minute process, and it's going to tell us to turn the ignition off. <clears throat> and then the ECU has been successfully flashed. So there we go. Turn the ignition off actually. So ignition is off. And once this is done, the ECU has been successfully flashed. So right there, 172 horsepower to 195 horsepower in about five minutes. Um, very easy to do. Of course, uh, you can do it parking lot at camp anywhere. It's pretty simple. So now we're gonna fire this thing up and see how it is. All right, flash is all in. So let's go ahead and fire it up. Keys in. Close our little dilly dow there. And here we go. Everything seems good, runs well, no check engine lights. Um, all of our stuff is good. Our little agency power exhaust valve works nicely. Loud, quiet, loud, love that stuff. So now we're ready to hit the trails and give our first test of the Vivid Racing Project Can-Am X3. So stay tuned more to at Vivid Racing UTV and our YouTube channel, Vivid Racing. Talk to you guys soon.